Okay, um, Notes. bookmark. Now, remind me, help me out. This was you guys who were at, mostly at the end of last lesson. Hands up if you are handing in your, if you would like to hand in your bookmark late. Because I know there was quite a few of you. Yeah, okay, alright, thank you, hands down. Um, hmm. Alright, now I did, I said this to a couple of people, notably Richard, because Richard actually um, had the sense to predict that this was going to happen, and he asked me, what day did we talk about this? Yesterday. Yes! <laughs> much, one day much, in much earlier, Much earlier. No, hold on, this happened before, this happened last week. Was it uh, Ravi, we talked about this earlier. Now, okay. Ravi, you're a good child. Here's the issue, okay? Um, Many of you want to hand in your bookmark late to me, and you've given me a variety of reasons, okay? Um, the main one being you've got an ag exam coming up, right? Is it, is it, to, when is it? What day is it? Thursday. Okay, so you got two days ago, okay? Now, here's the, I don't know if you ever uh, thought about the difference between reasons and excuses. Um, how would you define the difference between a reason and an excuse? Excuses are Reasons are legit. And excuses, excuses are do what? not have to be true. The reasons like you... <laughs> An asteroid fell on my say, house. Say it again, Ravi. Right, okay. So, like, a reason and excuse... I think that's... I didn't have an answer in my head, but that's a pretty good one. Um, the difference between a reason and excuse is... It, it's a legit... Something happened. I'm assuming it's true. It's not a lie, right? But what makes it an excuse is that it's not a valid reason that you shouldn't have done it. Like, it's, a, it's what I'd like to bring up as, you know, what justifies me, but it doesn't really justify you. So, example, how long have we known about this ag exam? Like, did it just come up? Whoa, we have an ag exam? <laughs> it's the how, HSC on the honest, Honestly, when was the... When, think back, when was the first time you heard about, like, you actually had a sense of the timetable and that kind of thing? Year seven. Like, like uh, six months? Yeah. Six months? Way before this bookmark was, um, and you guys knew as well, like the bookmarks as well were not, they haven't come out of the blue. Like we've been doing it every week. This is the third one now, okay? So here's, here's what I'm trying to put across to you, okay? Um, this ag exam might have been the occasion for a late submission, but it's not the real reason. And you are lying to yourself if you're saying, I can't hand this in at this time when it was due because of this exam. Okay? Now... If you remember one thing, okay, put, put your pens and books down and all that kind of thing. Look me in the eye for this, all right? I'll wait. If you can learn one thing from this, okay, because the point is not that you hand something into me. I actually hate getting your bookmarks because it means a crap little work for me, okay? So that's not the point. It doesn't count for anything. Like, we've talked about this non-assessment, okay? But this is a lesson for you guys, right? Um, you guys are at that funny kind of point where you're, you're not adults yet. But you're also not children either, like you have responsibility and that kind of thing, okay? Uh, the big difference, I think, between children and adults is not ability, okay? Like, if we talked about ability, you guys can do some things way better than a lot of the adults you know, myself included, okay? So it's not Plastics. like adults are just better at stuff, though, on the whole they are, okay? I think the difference is uh, children make excuses, right? Adults take responsibility, um, if something happens and an adult can't deliver, right, it doesn't, it doesn't matter that it's like, oh, we'll throw up some excuses or something like that. Well, what kinds of things do adults have to deal with? Like, you know, I don't have money or I, you know, I can't, I'm not going to be on time, I'm not going to arrive somewhere at a certain time or those kinds of things, right? The excuses mean nothing. Like, they don't help pay the bills. They don't, you know, get you to your destination on time, okay? An adult says, I screwed up, I did something wrong, work out what it is, now get on with it. Right? So, I'm going to suggest for most of, most of you, probably, the ag exam is not the problem. A failure to plan and be organized was the real problem, okay? Because you knew the exam was coming, and you knew the bookmark was due on a certain day, right? I admit this, the bookmark three was a longer one compared to maybe bookmark two, but people have still handed it to me either early or on time, okay? And if it was too much, you have plenty of opportunity to come talk to me, okay? So... If you're going to hand it in to me late, I'll, I'll take note of that, you know, but that's not the important thing. The important thing is that you learn and that you fix whatever's the problem that's causing this, okay? Because you're not going to get bookmarks all the way through next year because I 
would die if I kept on marking that many bookmarks, okay? But you're still gonna have to keep up the same level of work, right? It's just that you won't know that something is wrong because you won't have a bookmark that, oh no, I didn't have to, I couldn't hand it in on time. You'll just fall behind and then when the exam comes, you'll be like, okay, now I'm in trouble, right? So take some responsibility, learn to take responsibility for your own errors, okay? We all make them, so just learn from them, okay? Does that make sense?